Hey, hello, welcome back to another episode of Mel Plays the Binding of Isaac. For me, it's back to back. For you, uh, there's probably a day in between. We got a new save file picture because we killed, um, I guess we killed mom ten times, or at least nine times. Um, does it mean we get something new at the end? I'm not entirely sure. I didn't look it up. So let's go. Because why would you look things up when you have the internet? Uh, don't get me started on that though. It <laughs> Just don't get me started. <laughs> there were some cool times. I remember playing uh, uh, Grand Theft Auto. Uh, on uh, Grand Theft Auto uh, 3. Vice City and San Andreas. That was uh, in my student time. And I played it with a, a good friend, which I should really call, by the way. It's been years since I've seen him, but um, apart from that, um, there was GameFAQs was already a thing, internet was a thing. Um, and uh, should I pick that up? No, I'm not gonna. Um, I, I, you printed out guys. Like on the on the why where are all the items right the hundred collectibles on the first one and, and the, the sprays on San Andreas and stuff like that and you you print it out on paper if you don't, don't even remember what that is if you're looking at whatever year you're looking this um, but <laughs> and then you took a pen and you you striped down all the things that you collected but then you already collected a few during your run so you you had to you know go back to the location see if you already picked it up or not and always. When you're at 80, 98 or 90, 99, you, you are done and you have to go through the entire list to see what item you actually missed. Um, but it had its charm. And now you just watch videos and know the exact location and, and you know, someone else already done it. Like one day in, there's all these guys on the internet and uh, it's, it's the easier way, but it also takes away some of the um, nostalgia. I never ever... Um, I'm not one that wants to find it on my own. Tech fly, I think that's good. I I uh, I do do use guides for that kind of stuff. I I I I don't believe that there are. Okay, maybe there are people, but I. I if someone is. If you are someone that played those games, like if you play a game like the collectibles and you, with with over 100 collectibles. And you just sit there and you say, hey man, I enjoy this game so much, I'm going to look in every nook and cranny and I'm going to do it all by myself. If you do that, I have mad respect for you. Maybe you do like, uh, try to find as much and at a certain point you stop. Maybe you don't even care, that's also possible, right? You just you just uh, move on. I wish I was, uh, <laughs> I wish I had that tendency. Uh, but once I really like a game, I can't wait to uh, get everything. Is it worth to first spend five coins on a key? We're talking about how modern internet screwed uh, some gaming experience for me. I have played World of Warcraft for a very long time. More, more hours and days than I would dare to admit. I'm gonna pick up that card afterwards. But at the early days, you know, you had ThoughtBot, Too Hot to Bot, a website to find out stuff. Most of the quests you had to just read the quest log and try yourself. And if you really couldn't find out, you went to, um, to that website. At least I did. And then um, the raid, you know, there were some strategies and stuff. But we had a raid that, uh, a 40 people raid back in Vanilla that was... Had a lot of Danes in it. We actually been to Denmark one day. But what I'm trying to get to <laughs> is that um, it was before all the vid all the strategy videos. Like the you ran into a, a room with 40 people, and you ran into Molten Core, and you had no idea what Baron Gannon would do. But you ran in there, and you just wiped a few times and figured out what happened. You figured out what was best the best course of action. See, I'm glad I did that. And you figured out, you know, you, you, you had to think about stuff yourself. And that made it so much fun. That made it 
a lot of fun. And uh, after I think it started really live up from um, Breath of the Lich King, where you know uh, an alpha came out, a beta came out, and 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 as soon as a game got uh, got uh, live. When, when, the, when the beta phase was over and a new boss was released or a new raid was released all the strategy videos were already there and don't get me wrong I don't blame these guys for them they made really good guides uh, the, the I mean the guides were great but the problem was that um, you had to the, instead of running into a dungeon, right? Look into an immersion of an MMO. That's that's what always got me. You're with friends, 40 people. You gather around, and you're like the best on the server, and you know the, the people that really have no life at that time, and are the max level, have the best gear from all the uh, 10 and, uh, and and 15 man dungeons, like the Black Rock Depths or uh, five men. So I'll get all the the blue set. I had the blue warlock set back then, and then you go into Molten Core. Dreadness set so good, and then you know you see what happened, and then then later on it was like the first your first encounter with the boss was you watching a YouTube video, and it saw oh, man. I uh, and if you didn't, you're a goddamn noob. I always had a, had a hope that I would one day find a guild where people wouldn't mind about it, but were actually good. You know they knew what they were doing. And it would just, you know, let's raid once a week and try to find that stuff ourselves. And I never, I never got to that point. Which, uh, I still, um, the problem was that as soon as you have found some, including me, by the way, I'm guilty of it as well. But as soon as you found some uh, people that were um, dedicated, then they would... Why would they want to be in a, in a once a week guild? Because they want to raid more, right? They want to raid two, three nights so we can get more progress done. And, um, and, and honestly, as again, I was guilty with that myself. If I was uh, a few expansions that I was really into, into it, I, uh, you know, I want to pro progress. But it gets, okay, I'm not saying I'm, I'm, you know, I'm, I will never sell you, tell you that I'm, I'm the, the elitist gamer or whatever, right? I mean, look look where we are in Isaac, right? <laughs> but at least I was capable of, after the first time you got the, the, the for example, the, the boss in Ramus with the dancing, right? Uh, first time I got hit, second time I know how the thing goes, and from that point on I never get hit anymore, because I know how the boss works. I know how to dance and stay away from that crap, and we had people die over and over and over and over. And it made me so sad. Because then you are wasting your time, right? And don't get me wrong, I've, I've had... <laughs> I have uh, had a, a pretty number of, of stupid stuff, number of wipes on my on my, on my my sleeves. Especially when I was a tank, but of course that's... that's Okay, you know. As a tank you have to figure out to fight first before, before you can actually go somewhere. Um, I shouldn't have picked that up yet, did I? Was that a heart? I don't know. Anyway, uh, it, it really screwed over my uh, World of Warcraft experience, sadly. And it's never gonna be the same again. I'm not saying it's good or bad, I just I miss those days. I was non-productive in life, but you know, it was fun. It was good times. Yes, poison tears is good actually good acid tears would be even sicker but you know you can you can't have it all it's a DPS upgrade so I'll take it okay I guess that was it we got one bomb left I'm not gonna go for the secret room this was a big floor was it um yeah let's go into the shop you get the map. I'm not sure if it does. Um, it doesn't show the secret rooms, but I think it's here. I should have 
No, there was a stint support there. It's not there. Thought, you know, if you look at um, if you look at the map, you know, some symmetry should have been there. Should have been there. Widow. Widow, I am sorry for your loss. But I do feel... Ah, shit. There goes the dev devil. Oh, we were already at low chance anyway. And yeah, this is just... You know, this... I don't like this boss that much. I always get hit a few times. Hey, that's good. If it goes just like full health and five spirit bar, bar spirit. <sighs> it's good if you don't get hit as often as me. <laughs> the lost in the attic. And I'm also still lost in the attic. Feels so relatable, man. <laughs> Coin. Now we have no bombs. Oh, look out. Look out! Oh, wow, wee wee wow, wee wow. <gasps> Oh, man. Oh, man. Ah, we did it. Oh, look out. <laughs> See, if you, if you, if you start to learn, I, I always say that I hate the spiders, but all you have to do is stand still for a sec. Wait till, you know, stand still. Move, stand still, he will just jump on the place you just stood. It is, um... It is a learning process. The D10 reroll enemies, um... I think it's good at the later levels. But for now, I'm not... I'm not, not really... Well, what if you get like two gurgles or something uh, bitching about? Hey man, talking about spiders? <laughs> See, that's what I mean, that's what I mean. That's, that's what I like about um, get this game's progression path. I like games that have a really high skill cap, and I like games that have a, a nice progression path. And uh, this is one of them. Nah, that's not true. I only like it because of the crazy runs <laughs> when you can just steamroll the bosses. No. It's, it's, it's everything together, man. Man. Uh, spooters. Yeah, the poison really helps. The poison really helps. Even though you would think these spiders are immune to poison, but apparently not. It stinks. Not sure what it does. Let's think this through. We have the item room. Should we go all the way back? For what? What can we gain? A few more spirit hearts. We have more than enough spirit hearts. Let's go. The dark one, really? It doesn't work on bosses. Okay. <laughs> Ouch. Two hearts lost. Or one heart, I think. I hope. You know, if, if all else... Why? Come on, three... No, no! Oh, if... I'm so glad that this game has uh, me, me two hands on the keyboard, otherwise I would... hurt myself. That was just dumb, man. Come on. We, are, we can do better than that. We got, we got it. The devil room. Ooh. <laughs> kind of tempted to take both, but I'm only going to take this one. Bleed me dry. Is it good? 
I don't know. <laughs> Did it do what I thought it did? Oh my god. What have we done? <laughs> sure, pick up everything. Don't read anything, right? Why do my... Tears look so scary. Okay, I'm glad you picked that up. So, it, it just takes away all my health at the start of a run? And then it gives me flies and other stuff. I mean, I guess. I guess it's worth it, but it's 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 holy crap, man! It's dangerous stuff. And then it gives me flies, which are done after one room. Mm, I'm not so sure about these guys. <laughs> Uh, we might be up for a shorter run this time. Oh, this is too dangerous. Too dangerous. Yeah. What did I say? Two hits there. And not feeling it. I wonder if it hits me at the start of a floor or at the start of each room. Let's, let's find out. I didn't. Maybe it's a chance. Should have done this earlier late now can enter the middle either cannot pick up the heart do we go straight for the boss and get this over with <laughs> it's kind of tempted oh boy yeah, come on. no this is uh, this is not this is not my run <laughs> This is not it. I'm gonna try to hang on, but um, it's not it yet. Where would the item room be? I guess this one. Health down, <laughs> of course. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, it's over, man. Sure, take the pill. It's always good. I'm learning. I'm learning. Damn it, hell down, man. Oh. Sure, we get these guys, which I hate as well. Come on. Come on. The shop. We have two keys. Let's get the item room first. It's more important. Um, I think that's damage up. Stick it to him. It is a damage up. Anything? Any other? I don't know what else it does. But. Damage, not a problem. Health, big problem. Especially if I get hit every shot. Why? <laughs> Come on, man. Yeah, it's over. At least we got our steam seal. <laughs> For the next round, which we'll never get to. What happens if we, uh, if we enter the next room now? We'll never get there, man. It's over. I admit it. It's not my run. I wasted way too much stuff. Let's see. Um, I need a secret room though. More coins, which are useless right now. I cannot get hit anymore. There is a heart there. Probably was where I couldn't reach it though. So sad, because, you know, we're doing, we're doing damage, that's not the problem. Almost ran into it. Hey, let's go into the uh, cursed room, right? Tinted rocks. 
Oh, this is very scary. I regret everything. to time it but <laughs> uh, thanks for watching have a great evening bye bye